how it feels coming back to Greece to play for Panathinaikos once again? It's amazing, you know, uh, Greece and Panathinaikos is like my second home. Uh, I feel so welcomed here. Uh, you know, the culture is, is so familiar for me. Um, it's just amazing, I'm excited to be here. Mm -hmm. uh, how much different is Zach August uh, in 2020 compared to Zach August uh, of your previous spell in Athens? Yeah, um, I'm a lot more mature. I've learned a lot. Um, I've had a chance to play two years uh, of basketball in the uh, Euro Cup. Um, so I think I've matured and, and, and got a lot better and uh, a lot more tactical in the game. Comparing uh, to your previous spell in Athens, the only familiar faces are coach Vovoras, Frankie, Mitoglu and Kalajakis. Feels weird for you because you came back to the team, but it's a total uh, new team. Yeah, it is. Um, you know, I was hoping maybe, you know, there'd be a couple guys when I came back, but it's okay. You know, fresh faces. Uh, it's, a, it's, a new, it's a new challenge for us, mm -hmm. um, a new team. So I'm excited uh, to get to learn new players and uh, make new friends. What coach Wover has told you and convinced you to come and play again for Panathinaikos? Um, he, he said that basically it's going to be a rebuilding year. You know, he, he wants a new direction for the team. Uh, he's new at coaching. He wants great players with good characters to come in here, play with high energy. Um, and, you know, he wanted me to be a part of that. And, uh, and, I, and I thought it definitely would be a great fit for me here. Uh, during your previous uh, presence in the team, you have some uh, garbage time in the Euro League. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What have you changed? What have how, what have been changed since then? And uh, you're uh, here to have a big role right now in Van Hyvos. Yeah, at first it was a, a learning experience for me. Um, you know, I, I had I didn't have the best time in the games, but I got a chance to learn. I got to be experienced and understand what I needed to do. So I had two years to go back, mm -hmm. prepare myself, and now that I'm here, uh, at 27 years old, I think I'm, I'm mature and I'm ready to play at a high level. And uh, you know. So that yearly I can I can play in yearly uh, and I deserve to be here. Um, so that's my hope individually, but as a team collectively, you know I want us to, to make a great impact. You know a lot of people right now think that you know Pen Echo's not going to be a strong club, but we want to to make a, a footprint in the league. What are your personal goals uh, this year, as well as uh, team goals? Uh, what will be success and what will be failure for you? Um, the main goal uh, to start off is to really. We want to make playoffs. I think that's the number one thing. Making a playoff run is important, but we got to take it game by game. Um, for me individually, I just want to make any impact I can to help the team win. So if that's me going out there and getting 10, 15 rebounds, that's okay. If it's me 10 to 15 points, double-double, it doesn't matter. Whatever I can do to help the team win, that's what's most important for me. Uh, recently, you became a father. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Besides of the court, uh, will it affect you mentally in the court as well? Yes, a big impact. Now I'm not just playing for myself anymore, I'm playing for my family. So, uh, you know, hopefully one day that he can go up knowing that his father played in EuroLeague and uh, played in Greece, uh, one of his family's countries. So I think it's, uh, it's important for me and my family. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a lot more hungry now. Right now, if someone asks you uh, what are your advantages and your disadvantages uh, of your game, what do you tell him? My advantages, I bring high energy, uh, positive energy, uh, I rebound, I, I run the floor at my size very well, um, and you know I, I play with high energy. My disadvantages, um, I don't know, I, I guess I'll leave that for the, peop for the people to decide. What about your free throws? Better now? Oh yeah, I'm, yeah they are, they are better. That's definitely, that is for disadvantage for sure, um, that was definitely big. That has been worked on, it's definitely mm -hmm. better. Would you like to stay in Greece uh, for more years or you just want to prove this year that uh, you're really a good real league player, player and you'd like to have a, a better contract after that? Um, right now, uh, it's a little bit of both. You know, I, This is my home, like I said. I don't mind being here for, for the rest of my career. That'd be, that'd be amazing. But uh, you know, whatever is best for me and my family, um, my goal is to play the best I can to open the eyes of everybody in the league. Mm -hmm. uh, and from there, whatever happens from there, I'm, I'm willing to play. But I know I belong in this league and I'm, I'm going to make an impact. How do you expect the season concerning the pandem pandemic? What scares you the most? Honestly, this, the thing that scares me the most is that there could not be a season. Uh, you know, us basketball players, we love basketball. And it's tough, especially with everything going on now, that we wouldn't have a season. You know, I don't think any of us has ever dealt with that before, so mm -hmm. it'd be tough. Would you miss Panathinaikos fans, at least in the beginning of the season? For sure. That's the best fans in, in Europe, pretty much. Uh, that's going to be tough for us. Uh, they, they help so much with the game. Uh, they're such great supporters and fans. They're with us when we're winning, they're with us when we're losing, but uh, it's going to be tough.
If you have to make predictions for the top eight, what uh, teams would you pick? Us, Barcelona, <coughs> Real, Cheska, Milan. What's that? Five. Mm -hmm. Us, Real, Barca, Milan, Cheska, Ephes. The rest up in the air. I don't okay. know. And my last question for you, it's uh, about the Greek national team. Will you be available for the pre league tournament? Because, as I know, uh, you have some issues with some papers and you, yeah, didn't, yeah, you yeah. didn't play the Greek national team. Yeah, hopefully we can get that straightened out. Um, that's definitely... It's something that you want to do? Right, no, for sure. Of course, it's something I want to do. It's an honor. To, to represent any country would be is an honor and a blessing, for, for sure. That's uh, very important. And uh, when I have the opportunity um, and we can, we can work on that, that's definitely something I would like to do. So.